Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today we're going to be doing a Valentine's Day makeup look. Because Valentine's Day is right around the corner. This is more towards the colorful, dramatic, full glam side of makeup. Because that's the kind of makeup that I do. So if you're more of a natural girl... I'm sorry. So, I'm. We're taking the James Charles eyeshadow palette. This is probably the um, most colorful palette that I have. So that's why I use this one a lot. And and because it's actually really good at blending and doing things that I want to do, it's actually a really good palette. Um. So, yeah, not sponsored, by the way, so. So, you already know I like to put concealer on my eyelids, and that's my eyeshadow primer, and blend it out before I put the eyeshadow on. And I don't set anything, so... But if you want to set set your primer or whatever, then go ahead and set it. But I do not, so. Alrighty, so actually the first color I'm going to dip into is the ColourPop Dream Street palette. And we're going to dip into Magical and Shooting Star right here. These two colors. And that's going to be our crease or transition color. So. so next that we have this on our eyelids, we're going to take the James Charles eyeshadow palette. We're going to be taking this Morphe brush. I don't know what number. It doesn't say. It just says Morphe on it. But it's a like a brush like this. We're going to be taking this corally pink color right here. And a little bit of this color and it's going to make like a bright neon pink shade and we're going to put it right here. Now, in case you guys didn't know, pinks and red eyeshadow, when they're very pigmented and very good, um, they do stay in your eyelids. So, do not come for me in the comments saying, my eyelids are stained pink because of blah 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 blah. And I'm just letting you know, they're going to be stained a little bit after you take them off. So, don't come for me, okay? So we're taking this red color in his palette and we're going to put it in the very, very, we're going to blend that also. And then we're going to take some of this dark purple right here and darken this up a little bit. a little bit just to make it more Valentine's Day okay so next we're going to for this part of the lid I'm taking out like a little packing brush I guess you can say and I'm not actually going to be using this color anymore so goodbye we're going to be using this Morphe highlighting palette. It's in Stellar Impact. It looks like this. And we're going to be using this pink shade called Aurora. And we're going to be using that all over right here.
And then we're going to get our concealer. This is my trick that everyone asks me how I get my eyeshadow so sharp. Get my concealer and cut it like that. And then you blend. This is the completed eye look. And whenever I do my face and everything else, I will be back to finish the makeup look. So everyone, this is the completed makeup look. Um, I added... I added some um, pink glitter eyeliner right here, and I made the little hearts with it, and I also added some red lipstick, and this is Maybelline Superstay Matte Ink in Pioneer, and this lipstick does not come off at all. It is hard to come off. You can eat, you can drink, you can, like... It's wet right now, so that's why it, it's coming off. But once it dries, it's not going to come off. If you kiss somebody, it's not going to come off. So, this is a Valentine's Day look. Hope you guys liked it. If you did, make sure you give it a big old thumbs up. If you didn't, make sure you give it a big old thumbs up because we don't spread hate on this channel. And... not already, follow me on all my social medias. Make sure you go and do that. Um... Yeah, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Let me know what other YouTube videos you guys want me to make for you guys. And I will certainly, definitely, most, most likely make them for you. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. Skype here.